it's about small point in the comparison and generalization and also the application part of our lessons. So this is what is the comparison between political and physical maps. So political, the comparison of this political talks about what the boundaries of each um, map here in the Philippines. Then the physical, it talks about what the formation of the map here in the Philippines. Then, then what the comparison and contrast about topographic and climatic maps. So topographic, it talks about the elevation and the measurement of the map here in the Philippines. Then the climatic, it talks about the weather condition of every regions or what the provinces here in the Philippines. Then the economic and road map. So it talks about the economy, about what they are, the crops and energies that reach that certain um, provinces here in the Philippines. And the road map, it talks about the direction of the places here in the Philippines. All right, so did you get it, class? All right, so I have a um, short activity uh, you, um, you need to answer. So direction. Identify what types of map in the Philippines did the sentence get your name, all right? So, first is a political map shows the state and national boundaries of a place. Yes, Mr. Rodrigo, what's your answer? Very good, you got a correct answer. It talks about the political map. So, number two, it is a very detailed map and is generally used for direction purposes. So, direction purposes, what will this mean? Yes. Ms. Sanchez, very good. It talks about, the answer of this is the road map. So it talks about the direction of the map. Then three, a map is one that shows the physical feature of a place or country like rivers, mountain forests, and lakes. So what will be the answer to this? Yes, Ms. Tincha. Yes, you get a correct answer, Langa. So the correct answer is the physical map. So it talks about the, uh, what we call the formation or the feature of the map here in the Philippines. And the third, fourth one is a resource map shows the different resources present in the area of economic activity prevalent. So it talks about, yes, Ms. Maluyan. Very good. The answer is the economic map. So there are what they call the feature of this economic map it shows the richer, the, um, the richer they serve um what crops or the industries uh, that we, they provide here in the philippines then the next is what topographic maps are similar to physical maps which shows the physical feature of an area so what is the answer for the word yes very good it talks about topographic map so here are the generalization so what is physical map yes very good, thank you, Langa. The number two, what is the topographic map? Yes. All right. You are listening very carefully because the answer. Third is what is road map? Yes, Miss, Mr. Henry. Yeah. Very good. It's a nice idea. Or what is a climatic map? Yes, Mr. Armon. Very good. Right answer, I, what is economic map? Yes. Okay, very good, Mr. Sanchez. Then, five, uh, six is what is the political map? Yes, are we agree? Stand. Very good, it talks about the political map. So, that would be all our discussion for today. That's all, thank you.